What up, YouTube? It's your boy, Joe Apolios, aka Joe BZ. Welcome to my channel. First time ever making a YouTube video. So, this is gonna be very, very unfamiliar. We're gonna be touching base on just my, you know, journey here to the US. Uh, as you can tell from the way I speak, you know, I'm already from there. But yeah. Uh, yeah. So, let's get it started. So, I am originally from St. Lucia. Most of you might, have, might, might know where that is. Uh, small island in the Caribbean. Uh, population about 180,000 people. So, yeah, we were just like a little in the dot on the island. Uh, by the way, representing and supporting my sister, you know, the Alk family, cancer. Um, but yeah, back to the video. Um, so, so my journey to the U.S. was something that was really, uh, I said, I thought of like as a little kid, you know, coming to the U.S. at 20, 2010, at the age of 16, uh, to play in this uh, AC, Milan, AC Milan Cup, uh, sorry. Um, and for the first time, man, that was amazing. I had a lot of fun with my my boys from back home. I know uh, I might have a couple of clips of that, so I might I might put it up in there as well too. But yeah, it was it was fun. Um, you know, it was a blast. You know, I met a lot of great folk here. Uh, made some memories that really wanted like pushed me to want to come back. So fast forwarding, say ten years later. So or probably less than that. I would say ten years later. Oh, well, I would say like five, six years later. Yeah, I am. Um, started at JUCO, JUCO route, Jacksonville College. Um, it was all just new. Like I had no idea what I was doing, honestly. But I knew I wanted to go to JUCO, the JUCO route. Sorry, JUCO route, <laughs> JUCO route. Um, and you know, starting off, it was just very weird. Like I never really, you know, thought basketball. Was played like that. No, in the Caribbean, you were part of the European system, and coming to the US is a whole different side of the world. So that was just, you know, very new and fun. You know, I've learned a lot. You know, I've <laughs> met a lot of great, great folk, uh, a lot of, met a lot of brothers and sisters, and, you know, yeah. So, that route itself was bumpy, you know, just adjusting to the playing style of basketball here and just how fast paced it was. Like, <laughs> it was ridiculous. I remember my first time actually like hooping uh, at open session, you know, at school, just coming in. Man, I was gassed, out of breath. Like, I was like, what is this, yo? Like, am I, is this really for me? You know what I'm saying? And, um, just, you know, at the moment, I just said, you know what, I could do this. Yeah, I could do this, bro. You know, so I kept working hard every day, every day, coming to the gym, you know, practice. Because every gym we ran was just new, so it was just, like, so foreign. So I couldn't really, you know, understand, understand the drill until, like, one of my teammates broke it down for me. But it was, it was a journey, you know. And for me, like... What I would say for anyone who's trying to take on that route, coming from you know another country coming in, like just do it. Um, just go ahead and just don't look back, because it's a life changing experience that could open more doors, you know, as you journey through. And um, you know, being afraid to you know get out of your comfort zone isn't always a good thing. You know, you can miss out on, a, on your opportunity of a life opportunity of a lifetime. So yeah. But it was something that I've always wanted to do. Basketball was, has always been my escape from a lot of things, you know. Coming from a third world country into a first world country is like vastly different. You know, the culture is different. You know, you're gonna experience a lot of, um, you know, downfalls and uprights. And, you know, in that, like, you should never be afraid to go through them because they're these are the situations that are really gonna make you a better person, grow you into a stronger person, so you could actually help, or you know, be give advice to somebody who wants to take on that same route as you. So that was just my 
you know, overall thought of just journey that I wanted to embark on. And I think for me right now, looking at myself and looking at where I came from, you know, just in between that, you know, it was, it was well, well thought of and I commend myself, tap in the back, <laughs> for doing such a thing, uh, a risk, taking such a risk and, you know, being able to just get out of my comfort zone. So, yeah. So, just a little uh, video on just to start off with just on an idea of where I'm from and my journey coming here to the US playing basketball and uh, just me wanting to grow as a man and wanting to venture into different uh, facets of life. So, yeah. But y'all please go subscribe to my video. You know, it's nothing really long, six minute video. Uh, go subscribe to Joel Poor Use. Um, give me a thumbs up. Comment down what you want me to uh, to make a video on next. It's my first time. I'm not really nervous about making this first video, but you know, being in front of a camera, I've been in front of cameras for a long time, so I'm just excited to make some new content for you guys. So let me know down below in the comment section. All right. Peace. Yes, guys, we've arrived in Cleveland and we're on the bus. The bus has a bathroom. Do you see this? The bus has a bathroom. Open and shut up. All right, all these guys are right here on the bus. Okay, walk on, walk on, walk on, walk on. Come this way, sir. Come this way.